Uh, I thought we played a really good second half. Obviously, you look at our field goal percentage and 10 for 12 in the third quarter, 9 for 15 in the fourth quarter. I don't know that we've had two quarters back to back where we've been that efficient offensively. I uh, just felt like we shared the basketball really well. We took good shots. I thought we started the game and we took some early bad shots. Uh, and then once we settled in, we were good offensively. And a little bit up and down defensively. We didn't do a great job finding Whitish in the first half, uh, number three. But second half, we did a better job on her and then uh, just trying to limit them as much as we could. So proud of our team and uh, really good second half. And um, yeah, we were really efficient outscoring 45 to 26 in the second half. Uh, that's a pretty good half for us. It felt great. I mean, I give all my credit, all the credit to Brandy and Petra and all the other guards that drove in the lane and kicked it out when got the open three. Did you realize that was kind of a critical point in the game? They're kind of hanging there. Or you guys, that kind of blew everything open. Yeah, we definitely need to pick up our energy, and they really helped us do that, and that helped us get a good win. Are you comfortable, you know, in the situation now, halfway through your freshman year? Yeah, definitely. And the whole team, everyone just helps them now and keeps everyone giving them good energy. Alex, what did you think of how she played, first of all? Uh, Allie came in with some clutch moments. I think I lost my mind when she made that and one. It was <laughs> yeah, great. No, funny. That was unbelievable. It was great. Uh, yeah, she really stepped up and played her part really well. Did you practice that shot, that one? I think it was just spur of the moment. But <laughs> <laughs> she had a little English on it. like spun back in somehow. It looked like something you had done. Yeah. Kind of. <laughs> Alex, you... Seem to get on a roll there. Uh, mm -hmm. Late in the first half, the same. Or first half, you kind of got going, and then obviously the second half. What happened there, and you know, how how they work for you? Mm -hmm. Um, I think I was just getting uh, good looks at the high post uh, in the second half, and my guards were hitting me, and it was open, so it worked out. You got a big game coming up. I hate to look ahead, but you going home. Mm -hmm. That's a big deal. It's, I'm excited. <laughs> Very excited. You played well there. Yeah, 27 points, 14 rebounds. Cool. That's pretty well. That That's the goal. <laughs> what, what is going to be, you have a lot of people there, I assume, right? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I, I got a good number of people coming out, I think. Yeah, last Family year and they friends. They brought a bus, I think. <laughs> yeah. Is how far you have from here? No, no from. from oh, it's like it's like 30 minutes, 40 oh, minutes. Really? Okay. Yeah, not too bad. So is this a game? I think that's the only game with them all year, right? It is. It's a game yep. for you that's kind of different than every other game. Um, I mean, I want to try to not approach things differently, but approach, keep a steady approach to things, but I am definitely very excited to play back at home. You guys have three wins now in the conference. Last year was two of the whole year. Just, clearly, you're playing better. But tell me, tell me how that's worked. Why are you, what, what are you guys doing now that you weren't doing a year ago? Mm -hmm. um, I think, well, we have a lot of different offensive weapons, and I, I think we're doing a better better at utilizing all of them this year. Um, instead of focusing on one or two players, um, everybody's getting their shots more, and we're just, we just have multiple weapons to use, and we're using them, and it's working. Are there times in the game where you just say, I gotta get in, get involved more? Does that happen a little bit there? Um, I mean, I just, I kind of keep my mindset at keep playing, um, call when I'm open, and if I'm not, Open, dish it out, and just keep playing, I guess. Kelly, yeah, you were here a year ago. But from what you saw last year and what you see now, can you tell the team's better? Is that, is that a strong feeling for you? Or? No, yeah, definitely. It, you can see it just by playing, too. And We have really good team chemistry on and off the court. I think that's a really big thing for us. I take it nobody on the team talked about that. Hey, we got to worry. Nobody said that, right? That's not. Are you talking about last year? No, I mean, nobody said we're doing better than last year. Oh. That's not in your mindset. No, right? I mean, yeah, no, not really. <laughs> and, and both of the other let's go. Um, these next two next two games, road games, just how hard is that? Because clearly played well here. Mm -hmm. How hard is it going the road and putting down? I mean, we need to find a way to transition um, to the road, um, and I think it's just uh, having strong starts is what really helps, and I think we have yet to have. A, very, a solid, strong start on the road, and so hopefully we can do that um, this Wednesday. What do you think about that? I agree with Alex. I think we don't usually come out as good away on away games, so we just need to come out strong, confident, and play our game. The fact that you have two in a week, is that a big deal? 
bigger goal, or is it maybe make it easier? Just more focus on one. Um, I mean, it's kind of taking one game at a time. So it's we're not looking ahead. We're just playing in the moment, trying to play in the moment. Thanks. What's that autographs? <laughs> hey, I liked it today. Hey, I can't talk about that. I don't think it's clearly she had a little stretch there. You guys are, it was for the length of the game. I think it was eight. Yeah, eight at the end of the third quarter. She started going. Just find out what's that mean to you and what happened. Yeah, I'm just having a post player that can shoot it so well makes it really hard to guard, you know, on the perimeter. And she's shooting, you know, in Big Ten play, I think she's shooting like fit over 50% from the three-point line. So it just it makes it difficult for them to try to help off a speedy guard and get back to the corner. Um, so, yeah, both her and Alex can shoot it, and it, it stretches the D for sure. But I, it seemed to, Alex seemed to thrive off that, too. Obviously, they're closer than you can tell that. Yeah, I mean, certainly. Yeah, it's kind of fun for Alex to have another post player playing well and making plays. You know, they, they spend a lot of time splitting up with Coach Martinez and, uh, you know, just they, they cheer for each other and they get a heart for each other for sure. Talk about that third win. I, again, I know you not, that's not your focus, but you're already better off than your old year, year ago. Does it mean anything to you? Yeah, I think we're, we're heading in the right direction. Right. You know, that's probably what we're holding on to. And, yeah, yes, we're uh, really young. Um, but we're getting better, and we're, we're the kids are, are doing the right things. They're, they're spending time in the gym. I think our freshmen, more than any group I've ever coached, have been in the gym, and they're hungry to get better, uh, and that's awesome, and that's going to lead to good things, and it's already led to some good things already. And you look tonight, uh, you're, you're your top four scorers are freshmen. Yeah. And that's going to make you all. Yeah, that is, that is exciting. True freshmen, you're not redshirt freshmen, right. and, you know, true freshmen, and then Alex, and so, yeah, and I, I'm proud of Jalen, too. She went two for two from the field today, and, um, you know, with different players step up at different times, and, uh, it's, it's fun when they're young because it, it makes it excited for the future. Patrick was coming off, coming off a really tough, tough game, and she comes back today and plays like she thought she Yeah, yeah, she's just a quality player. You know, she takes she took good shots. I think uh, her first shot might have been a little rushed, but then after that, she took really good shots, and and she can score in a variety of ways. I mean, she can get to the foul line. You know, she gets by, and uh, she's not just a shooter. She's got a good pull up. She's worked really hard at that, and her pull up is night and day better from when she got here in the summer. So. You know, she keeps getting better, and she's just a really smart player. And we play her, you can play her in the top of the zone, bottom of the zone, you know, play her in different spots and buzz. And, you know, there's not many players that did come in as a freshman and we're throwing as much, you know, having her do so many different things, and she does it all well. Did you, did you have to say something for her just to, you know, for the last game? Or is it, was there any yeah, not really. Um, she just, she naturally moves on. I, you know, I think the one thing I said is let it come to you. I think the Iowa game, she was so excited. She's player of the week, and she just got a little sped up. And, you know, just to calm down, let it come to you, and, and take the shots in the rhythm of the offense. And uh, she did that today. And Brian, we haven't even talked about her. She obviously had a great all-around game. Yeah, almost triple-double. 17 right. points, 10 assists, and seven rebounds, three steals. Yeah, she kind of filled, <laughs> filled up the stats today. And I thought she was really big in the second half. They really struggled to guard her penetration. She got layups. And then when they did come off and help, then she found the shooters as well. Again, that seemed to be, it seemed, seemed to be focused. Yeah, and some of the times before I felt like she was getting in the rim and then, you know, the decision of when to pass and when not to, you know, as a freshman, I think she's gotten better at that and her feel for, you know, where everybody's at and just seeing everything around her, you know, instead of taking a tough pull up, she today she found the shooters and the times that they didn't stop her, she got all the way to the rim and got layups. And it was close game at that time. Did, did final score surprise you at all? Yeah, I, I thought the uh, fourth quarter, you know, we kind of pulled away a little bit and obviously, you know, they, they hit the three pointer at the end of the third quarter. We played so hard to build an 11 point lead and then they hit the three at the end. I was kind of, you know, hey, don't, don't let down. Let's go get back now start. And then we started the fourth quarter great, which was awesome. That could have been last year, maybe, or that could have been the start of trouble. Right. Is that right? Yeah. We had some of those moments, I remember. Right. Yeah, but you'd be playing great, but then something happens, you know, like Lake Basketball and both. Why didn't that yeah, I think maybe the chemistry. You know, it's hard to know exactly, but I feel like like they don't get down on each other. They pull hard for each other. Where or, or maybe last year, you know, they would have been down or you know upset with another teammate uh, a little more. Where this year, I think they're just a little more together, and so it probably helps you respond when there is some adversity. You do have a little more just for you feeling. Yes. Right? Yes. More yeah, more kids that can score for sure. Um, you know, we're starting to shoot the ball well, which is, has really helped. And obviously, Alex is so dangerous in so many spots. But, you know, Petra and Brandy uh, can shoot it. Jalen's making shots now. And so, uh, and then Allie and, and Courtney come off the bench, too. 
you know, and then, yeah, and Kennedy's had some really good games as well. So that all to work it out. Um, the crowd in that complex is a big difference. Yeah, it was certainly loud into it. And it certainly the fourth quarter was really loud. and it was, that, that was really fun. And, yeah, I told our players, go sign those autographs and get those kids back here because it's fun to have good atmosphere. And it makes a difference in the recruiting. Obviously, had some recruits here as well today. And, you know, seeing good atmosphere is important. Not, not to make fun of older fans, but when you have kids, the young kids, that's really is a lot of fun. Yeah, we're thankful for all of them, for well, sure. But, yeah, but yeah, the kids uh, can, can bring a little more life. and. Yeah, and so even like the Iowa game, we had like 1,500, but it was loud in the fourth quarter. And we've had some games where it's been loud in the fourth quarter, uh, and that's great. Thanks, Coach. Thank you. Thank you.